So what is going on guys, my name is Mr. Dalek JD. thank you for joining me where today my friends the third issue of the Call of Duty Zombies comic has finally dropped for you guys and I have a feeling this one is going to be absolutely insane for storyline information. This is about the transit crew being uh, disrupted by an AI security system, it's all up to Malton and we're going to get a lot of backstory about him which is going to be amazing and we're going to get another loading screen, possibly it's going to be really damn exciting. Now if you guys are excited make sure to press that thumbs up button let's not waste any more time my friends let's jump straight into the first few pages of the comic a point of egress would be optimal rust man thinks the egghead wants to find a door where is the transformational aperture that will allow us to leave stoolinger it's coming it's coming yeah well it better hurry because so are they come on come on say bye bye He's leading them. That's why they're acting smart. They're protecting him. Then Russ Man will give something to protect from. Your friend should open the portal now. My friend isn't answering my calls. Perhaps if we give him this element? Are you insane? You can't reason with zombies. I can't reason with any of you. Nevertheless, I continue the attempts. He'll save us. This is not how I die. I am useful. He needs me. Finally, I told you! Now that is more like it. You can gawk at the gadgets later, Martin. Now it's time to run. Misty, I. Why are you keeping these open? Do you want zombies to follow us? Russ man can't shoot this many. We need to get somewhere safe. Oh, yeah, because that's a thing we find all the time. This way. Why should we listen to you? Is your supernatural communication system giving you any further instructions? No, then this is the way. Help would be good. Russ man is starting to feel like Stoolinger's magic voice wants them to follow us. I believe that I can. No. You were gonna say you think you can activate something to stop them, right? I... Well, the last time you tried that, we ended up with zombies and those things. I think it's highly unlikely that this will... Welcome to Zero Base. Please speak your access code now. Oh my god, guys! Oh jeez! That's Sophia! And now we've got ghosts. German ghosts? Why is it talking like that? It's not a ghost, you idiot. It's some sort of holographic interface for the system that runs this lab. I would su submit this is based on a specific human, hence the feminine tectonic theme. Please speak your access code now. Fascinating. What did you do, you creepy nerd jackass? Access denied. Countermeasures. Oh my god, guys. Oh my. I am honestly so shocked that we have Sophia in the Transit Crew storyline now. It, it, Sophia looks exactly how she does in Revelations. She's not quite formed yet. Oh my god, this is crazy. Let's keep reading. Let's keep reading. Activated. That ain't good. I told you, what did I tell you? The situation is well in hand. I think our circumstances have improved. How exactly? Observe. <laughs> That's really cool. Ha, yes, see? All right, maybe you did good, Martin. I mean, it's great, but we're kind of stuck here. Now, we have time. I can make the system do what I would like for it to do. You can notice we still have that German Richthofen zombie as well, still following them in pretty much every scene almost. You don't need to do that! I want to do this! Besides, I'm testing a theory. He's the one! They're protecting him! He's the leader! Meat sacks ain't got no leaders! They're mindless! That one isn't so! Weapons detected, activate countermeasures. Oh crap! Martin, we've got a problem. Yes, I can see that. You are not permitted. I will be. No, no, no! Martin! There's a way out. There's always a way out. There's always a way out. Martin! Well, there you go. I told you. Good work with the door. Can you get through? I believe so. I can deactivate one of the... Grids. Go, go, go! Martin! Full intelligence activated. Just what it is that you believe you are doing. Don't listen to the computer. Just... Shit! 
You do know that if you hadn't deactivated the energetic countermeasures, these reanimates wouldn't be chasing you? Not helpful! Oh, I am very sorry. Did you think I was in the business of assisting intruders? Do you have any idea where we're going? Away. Alright. I am sick of running. Your heart rate appears to be dangerously high. <sighs> oh dear. I do hope the reanimates don't find you in this state. Need a find. It would be a true shame if someone were to guide them towards intruders. Rustman. Is Rustman seeing arrows? Great. The AI is leading the zombies to us. Locked. Normally, I'd be worried about conserving ammo, but... Better living through firepower. Continued living anyway. Let's go! Well, holy crap. Oh my god, you can see Ted. <gasps> what? Wait a minute. Just before I read any further, look at this. We have Ted from Transit. It looks like we have the golden rod. And almost like an origin staff, but it could be one of the things that was on the roofs in the Gorad Krovi map that we saw in the initial first trailers. What on earth? Shit! Kachunk! No! I got you! But who's got me? Stupid, stupid AI. Altering life support. That is less than ideal. Good luck with the chlorine gas. Damn, damn, damn! My god, man. Sophia is being absolutely savage against these people. This is great that we're getting to see more backstory from this. Yes, I thought so. Can't have chlorine gas corroding your systems, can you? I am a reasonable program. I am very sure that we can discuss this. Yes, you could keep me distracted while you test some other system to deal with me. Or... How are you so heavy? It's the apocalypse! Russ man can always find a good meal, unlike some people. I don't know what you're talking about! Don't make me drop you! It didn't taste like chicken! Crap, this isn't gonna stop them, is it? Lost my best gun. You should exit this room, go left, left, and then right, and I would do so with haste, as I believe the security measures will reset shortly. Martin, you're alive! What happened to the weird German ghost thing? It wasn't... You know what, never mind. It was a ghost. We had a calm and rational discussion with an axe. So where are we? Going? We're going to need to smash that glass. This door won't hold them back for long. I believe this is what we're here for. Whatever this device is, you don't know? You should try talking to a computer that has just had an axe lobotomy. As I was saying, this device seems destined for the element we found and appears to need four living humans to activate, which is not, I believe, a coincidence. Yes, yes, my friend says this is our purpose, that we are to activate it. Oh, now he has something to say. Well, whatever we're doing, best do it now. One of us each at these stations. What the actual... My friend says this is supposed to happen. The blood is how it knows we're human and not them. Now, now what? I believe we are about to see. Holy crap, did we... Did we fix the world? And that is all she wrote, my friends. There is no loading screen or anything like that. But jeez louise, the amount of storyline we've had in that is incredible. I thought the previous comic was good, but this just blows it out of the water on all fronts. This is absolutely incredible. So what did we learn from this? We learned that there's even more backstory with Sophia. In fact, she didn't just appear from in Gorad Krovi. There was a backstory to how she appeared in there. And it looks like the transit crew did in fact <laughs> not get on very well with her and they nearly killed her and what it seems to be is Martin is got, got an axe and stuck an axe right inside of Sophia how she's recovered from this we have no idea but it's ended with the biggest cliffhanger where our characters are put inside these chases chambers and this links in incredibly well to the cipher we had in Gorad Krovi where there was a, a cipher about some scientist labs and the subjects have been put on ice so to speak collecting their blood samples and the surnames or sort of the initials of their names are exactly the same as the transit crew characters and now we've seen this exact action take place inside of the comic.
This is all absolutely mind-blowing stuff, guys. If you did enjoy it, then be sure to press that thumbs up button. Leave it a big fat like rating, as I really would appreciate it. Let me know all your thoughts in the comment sections down below. Definitely don't include any comments about how bad my acting or accents was, because let's just ignore that. But if you want to see more videos like this on the comic and any other zombies stuff, make sure to press that thumbs up button, as I really, really would appreciate it. And also, let me know in the comment section, why do you think there's no loading screen included within this comic this time? It's very strange. So far, we've had a total of two new loading screens in these comics, as well as some others throughout the year, and even before Black Ops 3 came out, like this um, new moon loading screen, we've had the Newtown one and the Ascension one, but this, we didn't get one. That's very, very interesting. But anyway, I'm going to leave it here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in another video very, very soon.